can't really emphasise enough about how much I think places like this help people like us. This is one more place that's like a safe refuge and you know so different from anything I've ever done in my life since I was at school doing woodwork. And somebody told me once that women talk so, uh, face to face and men talk side by side. Every gentleman has a different story, but here they all have something in common. Men in Sheds offers support through hands-on social activities centred around woodwork. Gerlingborough Council and AGK set up the Shed in 2015, with the aim to tackle the difficulties people face when growing older. I've always been pretty good at looking after myself, but when I, uh, I said the wife developed dementia, um, and I, I eventually, I mean, I looked after her for three years, but it was hard work, and eventually I had to put her in a home because I had no choice. I couldn't, I couldn't leave her. It, it, she was getting so she was dangerous. Um, but then that left me on my own, which I said I, I can quite manage on my own, but it, coming home to empty house is not safe. After caring for his wife, who has dementia, Dave uses the shed as a break from his life at home. Experts say living an active life can reduce the impact of the different issues that elderly people face. Well, dementia is a condition for which there's no cure. Um, there are no treatments that reverse it, or, and there's not a lot that prevents it. Um, but the things that we do know that are good for people are looking after their general health, having a social life, maintaining their interests, doing things that they enjoy doing. And I think that for certainly a proportion of men, um, getting out into gardens, allotments, um, doing things with their hands is really important for them. I say we're all, we're all like messing about with bits of wood. And we're all, uh, I mean, I'm 84. Uh, but I'm still learning, because some of these chaps here know more about things than I do, you know what I mean? But I know cer certain chaps that uh, if I'm struggling a bit, I can go and say, can you help me with this? And they, they it's no too much trouble just to, to give me a hand. Between 10 and 20,000 older people in Nottinghamshire are at risk of loneliness, according to the County Council. The shed allows men to find a purpose and a way to interact with others. It's a, men, a place for men to meet up, to chat, to make things out of wood obviously, but really it's just to bring men together, somewhere to meet, have a chat and uh, just you know, learn from each other new skills and whatever. And some guys come in and use the facilities of the shed, make thing, things for the shed which we then sell. But equally you can make things for yourself and buy them, or bring your own wood in, make it here and take it home with you. So that, you know, it's. There's no limits really, no uh, restrictions, you can do whatever you like. For some members, this freedom creates a sense of security. All my life I've had like mental health issues, depression, battled it all my life. And I'm always looking for ways to sort of help myself with that, with, with, my, with my mental health and depression. And um, this, this seems, you know, a really, a really good tool for that. Yeah, the, the, the sort of all male environment that's supportive, that's really quite quite nourishing you know how people just like help you where's the toilets where's the step ladders teach you things which is really you know quite quite a special thing i think for blokes rob didn't waste any time joining the shed i'm 60 now so i'm like when i i could get into men in sheds at sort of the very first day of my birthday really when i was 60 i thought i'd get in early and you know apart from um brisk walking and a bit of tea dancing and ballroom dancing i don't i don't play any sports so um you know, this is, this is a, a good way to use my body in a different way. For me, I've got no energy, especially in the morning. And it's the will to want to do things, to get things done. And getting yourself focused, you're the oomph to get it done. You know? I mean, I like gardening. I go in the garden, so I'm hoping for better weather. But when it comes to winter months, and you're stuck inside all the time, you know, all you're doing is looking at talent and things like that. Noel believes that women have more options to fill their time during retirement. Women, no disrespect, but women seem to have uh, a, a better environment to work in at home than what men do, certainly in my day, anyway. 
Gellingborough Council want to help more people like Noel. It's nice to give something to men which is special and is only for them. We know that loneliness is extremely harmful to health. It's um, as bad as smoking 15 cigarettes a day. It also increases the chance of getting Alzheimer. People are living longer, so we need to do everything we can to address those issues of loneliness and isolation. Not only for older people, but also for, for younger people who might be isolated. But this is particularly important as we have an ageing population. Whether it be having a cup of tea or making a bird box, the shed is for every man. I didn't know what the future was going to be after I put the wife away. Um, things have turned out you know, quite, quite well.